got to be kidding me. I, I almost bought a place in Dublin. About, I come every year and have the last 25 years with my brothers. All right. Over every inch of Ireland. We're obviously from Donegal. Um, this year, we're going to be down in uh, Kinsale, and uh, uh, my friend Carol's going to take us out on... Um, then we're going to go see where the Lusitania sunk. We're going to be down at Old Head, and then we'll be back up to Dublin. But Dublin's Dublin's my home away from home. Well, John, you're going to like this, and anyway. just before we do, just to bring a bit of light humour to all these interviews before we start to finish, we do we do we've had we do a celebrity quiz. It's a, it's I'm a celebrity. How well do you know Ireland? It's ten simple questions. We've had everyone from Charlie Sheen to Steve Gutenberg to Tara Reid to Will Wheaton, to uh, Robert Davy, you name it, they've all taken part in it. So would you like to take part, John C. McGinley, representing Stan Against I'll Evil? Give it, I'll, I'll, give it, I'll give it my best shot. Yeah, I think you're going to do very, very well. You've been here a lot. Okay, so John C. McGinley, you're a celebrity. How well do you know Ireland? Question number one. Can you name any colour in the Irish flag? Green, yellow, and orange. <laughs> right, correct, green. Can you name any county in Ireland? Uh, Donegal. Correct. Question number three. March the 17th is known as what day worldwide? Paris. Correct. Question number four. Which of these is a famous Irish tourist attraction? Is it A, the Cliffs of Moher, B, Brandenburg Gate, or see Eistermau Castle. No, the cliffs. I've been out to the cliffs many, many times. Correct. Number four. That normally catches a few people. Question number five. Uh, because you're the cliffs of more, you've been to the cliffs of more, you'll probably get this right as well. Which of these is a famous Irish river? Is it A, the River Shannon, B, the River Rhine, or C, the River Lech? Uh, well, I, I want to say Shannon, but... Uh, Correct. I the, the lift, I would have said, I would have thought you would have said the Because Shannon's correct, yeah. Question number six. Uh, this might be a bit tricky, so I'll give you a hint. Can you name any famous Irish sports star? And this guy's been all over the news, and last year I'll give you a hint. He fought Fly Medwether in a mixed martial art, and he sort of vandalized. Of course. Cor cor correct? I'm a yeah. Question number seven. Can you name the famous alcoholic beer founded in Ireland? Well, Guinness. Correct. For sure. <laughs> yeah. And then Harp, Harp is the Guinness Lager. So, so there's two for you. You're seven from seven. Question number eight. Ireland is once Ireland was once occupied by what country? And it's our next door neighbours. I can tell you, the Spanish. The Spanish came in through the West. If you want to say England, you yeah. can. But the Spanish also occupied the West. Yeah, you're, you're, I, give, I give it to you for the England and you've touched on a bit of Dharamada history with, in relation to Spanish occupying Ireland as well. Going very well, 8 from 8. Question number 9. What plant or shrub is the national symbol of Ireland? The clover. Correct. And question number 10. Finally, for a perfect score, can you name any famous Irish actor or musician? When I watched Brian uh, in New York at a play, I guess that was about the best performance. He did a play called The Rat in the Skull. Mm. And Brian, uh, Brian's from Ireland. Yeah. Uh, so I'll go with Brian Cox. Correct. John C. McGinley, and I'm a celebrity. How well did you know Ireland? You scored a perfect 10 out of 10. That we've, uh, we've got six 10 out of 10 so far, so that puts you giant top. We've had over 45 celebrities take part so far. So you're in giant, you share the lead with another six people. So hopefully by the time it's going, this quiz has been going a year and a half once we have it sorted. When we come to the final day, you probably you'll still be out on the top and we might all get you back for one last tiebreaker question to see who's the winner. John C. McGinley, it's been an absolute pleasure talking to you on the airways tonight. We wish you all the best. We're eagerly anticipating and very excited here in Ireland for the premiere of Stand Against Evil Season 2 out, out tomorrow, June the 17th on Fox UK in Ireland. And before we let you go, John C. McGinley, is there anything you want to say to your, uh, to your many Irish fans uh, who followed you down through the years and anything you want to say in 30 seconds about Stan Against Evil. 
I can't wait to see everybody. I'll be there towards the end of August and the beginning of September and uh, down in uh, Kinsale and Kerry. And then I'm going to come up to Dublin. I can't wait to see everybody. I always, uh, I always reach out and, and, and try to talk and get with as many people as they can when I'm in town. So I look forward to doing that again. John C. McGinley, it's been a pleasure talking to you on the airwaves this evening and we wish you all the best in your future endeavours and we also wish you all the best in future success with Stand Against Evil. Take care, mate. Thank you. It's great to talk to you. All the best. Cheers. Thanks.